This is Helsinki, Finland's capital, a city of culture, statues and seagulls. But beneath the surface, Finland has one of the most comprehensive disaster response systems of any country in the world. And is sharing its expertise with international partners, including NATO. It is a country prepared for any crisis. We are prepared for natural disasters, floods, uh, forest fires and man-made disasters terrorist attacks, uh, even the worst case scenario of war. And Finland's attitude towards crisis response is born out of experience. Four planes darkening the sky of Finland. We and lost 90,000 people during the Second World War. That was a huge loss in this small country so that everybody understands why it is important to be prepared in every possible uh, crisis. After Helsinki was bombed repeatedly during the Second World War, the authorities in Finland put measures in place to make sure that if it happened again, the nation would be ready. Through these doors, down this elevator, is what looks like a regular children's play area, gym and sports centre. However, this is also a custom-built air raid shelter designed to house 6,000 people for up to a week in a crisis situation. Overseeing it is this man, Yari Markkanen. This cave is 230 meters long, blast-proof doors, plenty of entrances, this kind of toilet facility, beds for over 600 people. In Finland, every building with a floor area of more than 1,200 square metres is required to have a shelter to protect citizens. But underground shelters are just one of Finland's civil defence measures. What we're doing here is an exercise involving police, fire department and emergency medical services in order to maintain and build up the maximum effectiveness for real-time emergencies. In the end of the day, it always comes to rescuing people manually. We need to know our, our environment to be able to function effectively. We are playing with the time. Finland's comprehensive approach to civil security also involves training key decision makers and business owners in what to do if a crisis situation occurs. These resilience measures are a priority for Finland, a NATO partner, and NATO allies alike. And they have long worked together to prepare for crises and disasters. The opening in Helsinki of a European centre for countering hybrid threats will further strengthen cooperation. NATO has great standards for civil preparedness and we are following those and, and cooperating with ours and sharing information in both ways to improve resilience capabilities. While underground shelters and crisis response measures are a last resort, in times of increasing uncertainty where cities across Europe are on heightened alert, if a crisis does strike, Finland will be ready.